starting our tour vlog. <laughs> We're at LAX. I was supposed to go to LAX. Huh? It's just hot air. Oh. <laughs> We're so excited to go to New York. Hey, pre-orders at this time for JFK. When we retire, we thank you for your service. We welcome you aboard your flight to JFK here. Oh, sorry, you're going to be like that. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, Like, even a group itself, like, you just want to tell me and I'll, like, make an address for you. That sounds good. Yeah, I'll tell you if you know, take some notes on that tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Rehearsal done. <laughs> I want to dress up like an elf <laughs> and then open the door and knock and open the door. <laughs> just start dancing. It's show day in New York. We're ready. We're gonna head to the venue with all of our stuff and do a little sound check. We just did sound check for show. Lily is doing sound check for her. We're at Mercury Lounge. show done and it was so fun i'm vlogging it was so incredible i can't even get over it new york was just everything and more can't wait to do it again we go to chicago tomorrow but yeah wow tonight was just so fun i can't believe it everyone knew the words it was so cute and i had so many friends in the crowd it was just the best Okay, that's what I want. Heading to Chicago. Actually, you won't even guess the song. It goes like this. So live your life. Hey, hey. Yeah. And I'm doing a little interview. Right in early. Billy Joel is a singer songwriter known for her unique approach to storytelling in her songs. Haley joins us now with details on her first headline show at Shuba's Tavern. Welcome. Thank you so much for having me. Right and congratulations. That's exciting. How you feel about the show tonight? I'm so excited. First time I'm in Chicago, and yeah, it's going to be great. So awesome. You said one's accompanied by Michael Florence. Take it away. You said you're finding yourself. It's not about anyone else. You just want the best. But I know you meant you don't want the rest. Said it's all up to the universe. 
Cause you can't just say the words You're not willing to try But you can't decide Think I can read between the lines Oh, you always know all the answers But you can't seem to make up your damn mind You don't want me now, you might want me later You leave out the truth, don't want me to hate it so So go have your fun And I'll just remember How I've been yours for months And you're in two places at once Try again Vlogging On our way to the Chicago show It's gonna be fun Any words of wisdom? Sing that's a good one. That is a good one. <laughs> to vlog but it is monday now december 11th and oh my god the first two shows were just so magical new york was incredible chicago was amazing i just can't thank you enough if you came to either of those shows and made them what they were because i will truly never forget them i'm vlogging Thanks. I'm telling the vlog about how incredible New York and Chicago were. Do you want to say any words? So incredible. No, they were great. This is the one? Yeah. Thanks. They were amazing, and the meet and greet was just so fun getting to meet all of you. Um, and sorry, the venue is just really cold, but it was just like truly unforgettable. And I'm just so touched that people, you guys, take time to come to the shows i know it takes a lot and to like buy a ticket and that you like come to the shows and sing every word with me it's just insane and it reminded me why i do this so thank you so much 
two shows left. Um, I basically just chilled all weekend. I'm, I've just been avoiding people like the plague because I don't want to get sick. But I chilled all weekend in LA with my dad um, and got a spray tan, did laundry because and packed because tomorrow we go to Portland for the last show. And then I'm just like home in Portland for the holidays. But tonight is the LA show. So we're at the venue now and it's been like straight chaos since we walked in. But we've been dealing with it. And yeah, I've been a little upset about certain things about tonight's show. But it is what it is. It's still going to be a great show. So I'm excited to see my LA peoples and Portland tomorrow. So yeah, but it's been the most incredible tour with the most incredible crew so far. Two more shows and then London in February, of course. So yeah, I'm going to try to live in the moment tonight and take it all in. And yeah, that's the update. Slash my parents, friends. By the way, my parents are in the house tonight, so shout out to them. I think there's like some old teachers here. Um, <laughs> hand goes up. Uh, but as long as there's no ex boyfriends in the crowd, I think we'll be okay. Uh, <laughs> and if there are, well, your ears might be ringing tonight. But anyway. The peeps in my hometown. Westland and it up. Westland and it up, he said. Yeah. Oh no, West please Lynn never Lynn, say that again. <laughs> okay, tour is over now. I've had a few days to like decompress, take it all in, and I just can't get over it. I can't believe that that happened, and I just can't believe how magical it was. Um,. I guess the last clip I took was from the Portland show, but that show was so surreal and amazing. I've, like, never had a hometown show before, and so many people came out, like, friends, old teachers, my parents' friends, um, and, yeah, like, it was just insane how many people came out to support and made my heart so happy, and the show went really well. I was so sad that it was the last time doing it until Feb, um, but... Yeah, and then after the show, we were just, like, celebrating, and we actually went out for a drink with some people um, after in Portland, which was fun, and yeah, and then um, Michael and Lily and her husband, Jeriel, were staying in Portland for the next day, so then the next day, they all, we all went to, like, a cafe in my hometown, which is such a crazy crossover that they were here, um, and yeah we just hung out and drove around I kind of showed them the town and then um Michael and I went to Portland to walk around a little bit and 
went out to dinner with my mom and it was just fun to have him here and yeah and then the next day he left and I've had like a couple appointments and stuff and I've honestly just been resting like I've just been so tired um I feel like today I felt semi-normal so that's been good but truly 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 like can't thank you enough if you came to a show bought a ticket bought merch like sang the lyrics so loud with me every show was so magical I can't believe we pulled it off as well as we did every show was such a success and it just meant the world to me to share those moments with you and yeah spend my first headline tour with you guys because you're truly the best and I feel like the luckiest girl in the world um so thank you and I can't wait to do it again and hopefully come to all the cities that you know I get messages about so much craziness to look forward to um also the London show sold out so that's an update crazy update um so I'm really excited for that show on February 8th and yeah, I'm just going to be hanging with my family during the holidays now, taking some time off. And um, I'm going out tonight to SantaCon with my friends. So we'll see how that goes. I've never been. I'm not dressing like Santa, so I don't know how that's going to go down. But yeah, um, that's basically it. But from the bottom of my heart, thank you for making this the most magical few weeks. And I will truly remember it forever. And I can't wait to see you guys again soon, so until next time.